Who wants to help me make crock pot hot cocoa? Jump in. Today is a chilly January day, so we're gonna make crock pot hot cocoa. I've never made it before, but I got a recipe from a friend that sounds delicious. I've already added seven cups of milk to our crock pot. Now we're gonna add two cups of semi-sweet chocolate chips. We're gonna add those, Colin. Dump them in here. Hold, hold the whole thing. Oh, one at a time will take a while. And dump them in. Woo! Next, we're gonna add a can of sweetened condensed milk. Can we do that one, Maya? Gotta get it all out of there. Next, we have one cup of heavy whipping cream, which we're gonna add. And the last thing we have to add is just two teaspoons of vanilla extract. Vanilla extract is the best, is a, something that smells, is the best smelling thing. In the Maya world. loves the smell of vanilla, she does. So two teaspoons. There's one. <laughs> the next step is to whisk all of our ingredients together and then we're gonna cover it and cook it on low for two hours. Gotta whisk it really good. Is it thick, Maya? Yeah, so I'm stuck in. Oh, <laughs> I think you got some of your nose. <laughs> There's chocolate chips at the bottom, so whisk really well. Yes, there's a lot. Your turn, Colin. It's okay, just stir, stir, stir. This hot cocoa is going to come in handy because we're about to venture out in the chilly, crisp January day and go for a hike together with some of our neighborhood friends. I think you whisked it well. Why don't you put the lid on now? Yes. Lid on, Colin. And then you gotta plug it in and turn it on. There you go, to low setting. And we're not just making hot cocoa in our crock pot, we're also gonna have a whole hot cocoa bar set up for when we get home from our hike and it's gonna taste so good. We're gonna have lots of candy canes and marshmallows, chocolate chip sprinkles, all the fun fixings you can think of to add to your hot chocolate. We're gonna have them. Oh, it smells like vanilla. It takes about two hours for it to be ready, so it should be perfect timing by the time we get back. Yep. Not ready yet, is it? It still looks pretty white for hot chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> Did you see what this owl's name is? Um, it's Shakespeare. It's Shakespeare. That's a cute name for an owl. Yeah. Are there more owls over here? We're at Owl Hill Nature Sanctuary and we're checking out the owls they have on display and then we're gonna go for a little hike. We're just gonna do about a mile hike, so something pretty easy but enough to get a little bit of exercise and to be excited to get home to our hot chocolate. Owl trivia time. What do you call a group of owls? So like you have a pack of wolves. What is a group of owls called? Do you know at home? We studied owls in science class. I don't know if we studied this. You don't remember? I don't what? remember what? if we did. A group of owls is called a parliament. A parliament of owls. I've never heard oh, of it. Have you heard of that? I remember that. All right, yeah. should we go to the trails now, Colin? Uh -huh. Let's go! We are staying on the yellow route, Sharp Creek Trail. You guys have to help me make sure we stay on the yellow route. Okay. okay. I probably shouldn't tell the kids this, but I have a tendency to get lost when I'm out hiking. I'm not gonna get lost today because it's an easy, quick trail, but it helps that everybody knows that we're staying on the yellow routes. We're looking for yellow route markers <laughs> everywhere. Are you girls nervous? I want to get lost. You want to get lost? <laughs> yeah. I, get lost. <laughs> I also forgot that we never introduced all of our neighbors to you, so you don't know who's here with us. So let's do that real quickly. You know Addie. Think you know Maya. Think you know Colin. Who do we have here? Annabelle. And then we have Caroline yeah. and Emerson. Emerson. We've got a whole crew of neighbors. All right, let's yes. keep going. Yellow trail. You want to look at the creek? It's beautiful, isn't it? It sure is. Go this one. Wait, what is that, that one, Colin? 
the red and the yellow. So which way do we go if we want to stay on the yellow trail? We go that way. Off that way, let's go. We last walked this trail during the fall and I think we did it in the spring. It's our first time in the winter and it is so different in the winter. It is so brown and a little dreary looking in the spring and the fall. It was absolutely gorgeous. It's gorgeous now, but a different gorgeous. Do you like it, Annabelle? Yeah. It is a different type of pretty, isn't it? Yeah. And there's a bridge that you can walk over. It looks like a bridge, doesn't it? Wow, I don't know. Whoa. It's like a bridge. It is like a bridge. It's a bridge. What if you're supposed to cross it? Where did you get off? Get off. Uh, it was that part of the tree. I that. think that part of the tree is like rotting. <laughs> Are we on the right trail, guys? Oh, uh, yeah. How do we know? Yellow dog. Yellow marker. Time for our next owl trivia. Uh, Owls like to stay up all night and they hunt all night. What do you call an animal that's up during the night Not time? Nocturnal. 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 You guys are smart. We learn it too fast. It's like the first thing you learn when you learn about owls. Is it that they're nocturnal? Yeah. yeah it's like... I couldn't stump you guys. For another owl question. How many different species of owls do you think there are? 90. Mike guess 90. Uh, 100. 100. 110. Here, let me guess it. Um, maybe somewhere around 200. 100 years. Oh, I actually think 230. Oh. 230. There are over 200 species of owls. So I think Caroline is our trivia winner. I don't have a prize for you though. Sorry, Caroline. It's a tad bit chilly today. It's about 48 degrees, so it's not too bad. But I have to say, even on the coldest days when it's snowing here, we try to get outside every single day, even if just for a little bit. That fresh air, the sunshine is just so, so good for you. We wrapped up our hike and built up an appetite, so we're passing along some Girl Scout cookies to share. These are your favorite type of Girl Scout cookies, right, Addie? The shortbread ones? Mm -hmm. Yes. Oh, go on, go on. Oh no, oh no, okay, oh no. Those are your three. <laughs> Here you go, Emerson. Yeah. My favorites are tagalongs and thin mints. I could just eat those nonstop all day long. They are so good. What are your favorite types of Girl Scout cookies? Tagalongs. You like tagalongs, Caroline? Do you have a favorite, Annabelle? Tagalongs. Tagalongs too, Emerson. What about you? Mint. The thin mints, those are good too. I like thin mints. Thin mints, yep, those are good. Well, I thought the hiking wore them out, but apparently they have a ton more energy to play sharks and minnows and freeze tag and tons of other outdoor games. Who's ready for the hot cocoa bar? Come on over! Cocoa cups over here. Pick out a cup first. Ooh, it's a toy. And we have lots of toppings for your hot cocoa. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, this is mine. You got some chocolate chip chunks in yours. That looks good. Yay. We have chocolate chips, salted caramel crumbles. Chocolate sprinkles, rainbow sprinkles, white chocolate, peppermint sticks, marshmallow cubes, and baby marshmallows. What do you think of it, Addy? Awesome. What do you about you, Maya? Good. What do you put inside yours? Yeah, everything. Everything? <laughs> That's my girl. Emerson, what's going inside yours? Um, a peppermint stick. Whatever these are called. <laughs> what one? White chocolate? Yeah. Oh, white chocolate chips, those are good. And, yes. and chocolate sprinkles. And I have to say, probably the best hot chocolate I've ever tasted. So I encourage you to try that recipe at home. Crock pot hot chocolate, absolutely delicious. Wow, the toppings were definitely a hit. 
It looks like the marshmallows, the white chocolate chips, and the salted caramel crumbs were the favorite because they're about out. More toppings? No, you didn't get enough. No, no, I didn't get enough toppings. I totally forgot the most important Whip ingredient cream. of hot chocolate. Whipped cream? Whipped cream? How did I forget yeah. this? Yeah. I know. Why did you miss it? I don't know. I can't believe it. Oh my God. More than anybody else? Okay, okay. Oh my god. Whoa! <laughs> Today has been a pretty fun day, but there is something else super exciting happening downstairs right now. I'm gonna go check it out before I let the kids in on the surprise. with all of us getting our swimsuits and jumping in a nice warm hot tub, but it's gonna take a while for the water to get in, the water to warm up, so it's gonna have to come another day. XOXO, thanks for watching!